Hey, what's going on, everyone? Today's the 25th of August, 2023. It's official. Disney stock is now trash. Let me tell you why I'm making that statement off of the price chart. Take a look at this, okay? First of all, I got a price prediction already here on the chart in Disney, and you guys can see that I've been expecting the market in Disney to go down for a while. Market has maintained support around $85. Then we saw our last move to the upside after earnings was reported, hit resistance around 92. And then we got this area of weakness in Disney yesterday. Finally, take a look. The market now is well within our price target area. Now, let me show you. Let me zoom out. Well, first, let me put this on the weekly chart. Okay. Look at this. This is the next lowest price in Disney. And it was back in 2020 during COVID, right? Look at that. That was the next low. This is the next low outside of this low in March of 2020. It goes all the way back to 2014. That is going to be the next low in the market in Disney. We haven't seen price in Disney hit this low in about nine years. That is why the market in Disney is trash. It's because we're making lows that we haven't seen in nine years. But what about the mantra that goes with so many people on YouTube telling us to hold these stocks for 10 years, 15 years? So if you would have bought Disney in 2014 and you told yourself, I'm going to hold the stock for nine years. Congratulations. You're now breaking even. You literally evaporated all of your profit in Disney within that nine year span. If you would have bought Disney back here October 2014 and you would have sold it at the high in March of 2021 look at your profit you're up 156 percent you literally have given that back to the market you were sitting excellent in the market in Disney so why do people tell you a time frame on when you need to sell stock that's crazy that's asinine Now, the problem would be is if Disney's going to continue to go lower. Yeah, we're hitting areas, we're floating around an area that we haven't seen in about nine years of price, right? What about the next low? What do you think? Here? $70? That would have to be the next target. Would be 70 bucks if the market in Disney is not going to hold that. So I mean, this is one area here. This is the second area. $70. Okay. So let me extend these lines over to our price prediction. Because we may already have our idea fixated on the low around $78.50 in Disney. Okay, so yeah, we're pretty much there. To hit that $78.50 price, nine year low, we haven't seen. Because I'm not changing my price prediction. The price action yesterday with the high volume tells me that our analysis is still on point for the weakness. Okay. I just wanted to come in and show you all that the market is definitely still bearish in Disney. The downtrend is still intact. That's it. Okay. Now, if the weakness continues, let me see this on a weekly charts because we'll have to lower our target back down to like $70 if the weakness continues in Disney. So look at this on the two weeks real quick. Let me get rid of this. That's definitely still weak into the market in Disney there too. That's some weakness there. Off the two weeks chart in the next nine hours and 10 minutes, market close on the low. Yeah. We're still expecting the price in Disney to go lower in price. Here it is on the three weeks. Okay, don't see any strength over the last three three week price bars. Here it is on the five. Again, looks weak. Here it is on the monthly time frame. Again, looks weak. Take a look on the three. 
And then let's look at this on the six months. The six months chart in Disney massively, massively looks weak. Massively. To the point where, yeah, it's feasible that we could see the market run down to $70 in Disney. Outside of the market trying to hold support right now, which is pretty much our ultimate area of TP. So I do suspect that we're going to hit that. My area of ultimate TP in Disney, which is around $80, which is like 7% move total from when we initiated this prediction. But that's it. I'm done. I'm just wanted, I just wanted to show you that Disney is trash right now. And then add this to the picture. It fell through our support line. Another reason why this market currently is trash. It's weak. Until things change, that is the current analysis into the market at Disney. I know many of you don't like that because you've been told to hold the stock in Disney and buy the dip in Disney and the dip continues to go on. The chart is telling you not to buy these dips. Be careful of what you listen to. Be careful. You might be the same person who will come through and hold the stock for 10 years and then come to find out you evaporate all your profit and now you're breaking even. That's not good use of opportunity cost of money. That's not good. All right. So go ahead. And give me your thoughts, though. I'm here. Hit that like button. Share the video. Also subscribe to the channel. And one thing that I do push here on this channel is to ensure you all maintain your profitability. And the way that I've come to know to do that is by looking strictly at the price chart. 